Good day everyone, it's Jim, Victor Alpha 7, Sierra Hotel Golf in beautiful Chilliwack, BC, Canada. Today's video is going to be about setting up an iGate server using only Direwolf. I'm going to be using my Draws hat on a Raspberry Pi 4, but I'll be doing it in such a way that you'd be able to do this with any sound card based setup, including Jason KM4 ACK's build a pie. Let's get to it. So I assume either you've installed and ran Jason's build a pie script, KM4 ACK, you've installed Direwolf, or if you happen to be following along with me directly, you're using a draws hat from Northwest Digital, and you've run Basil's core config script, N7NIX, which will give you Direwolf as well. So here is my draw station. I'm going to start up terminal. Now in the draws world, Direwolf is store is installed as a service. Um, so its configuration file is in the etc directory. So on my draws hat, I'm going to type sudo nano slash etc slash direwolf.conf. That should drop me into my Direwolf file. On the build a pie script, start up the terminal here. Your Direwolf configuration file is actually in the home directory for Pi, so you just have to type in nano direwolf.conf, and that should open up your Direwolf configuration file. Okay, let me flip back to my draws hat here. There's only a couple of places here that we need to actually change to become an iGate server. As you see here, section four, IG server, IG logon. Okay, so we'll just scroll down here. Now on my draws hat here, the sound card setting looks a little bit confusing. On the build a pie side, it should be much simpler. You should just have one sound card and it will likely look more like this. This should already be configured in yours and you shouldn't have to change it on your build a pie. Back to the draws hat. I'm going to continue going down. Nothing here really needs to change. I wouldn't touch anything. Possibly your my call, but again, this should be already configured if you ran Jason's build a pie script or Basil's uh, core configuration file. Don't need to worry about beaconing here, though we will beacon. Not going to be a digipeter, uh, primarily because we have enough digipeters in my area. I don't think adding another digipeter would add any benefit. So you want to really make sure of that if you are considering setting up a digipeter. Make sure you don't have too many in the area already. So you may just cause a bunch of collisions and conflicts. What we could use, though, for sure, are internet gateways relays of packets into APRS. So here's our first change here, the internet gateway. We need to specify the server that we're going to connect to. So all we need to do is take out the comment here. Now this is specified for North America. I think we could also put rotate in here and it would automatically select a tier two server, server for you. Next area that we need to change here is the IG login. You'll want to put your call sign in here and then your passcode. If you watch Jason's recent video, uh, he shows you how you can obtain your passcode. Flip over to the build pie here and open up another terminal. You can also use his program that should be installed on your Pi called call pass and then type in your call sign and it will generate your password for you for the APRS. Let's flip back to the draws hat here. We'll make sure that that has been entered in correctly. Now that's all we need to do right now just to become an iGate relay. Now we can also choose to make ourselves show up on the internet. I like to do this. So what we're going to do here is uncomment one of these. This send to equals IG is internet gateway. That means we're going to send to the internet only. It's not going to go over RF. Okay, symbol iGate overlay T is fine. Now, we need to get our latitude and longitude. 
show you the easy way to do it. And it should work on both your build a pie as well as the draws hat. Open up a terminal and just type in GPS mon, assuming you have a GPS plugged into your pie. That should give you your longitude and latitude. Flip back to our configuration here. My latitude 4910.95 north, 12156.41 west. Put in a comment, whatever you'd like there. I'm putting in Raspberry Pi draws. Split channel, I'll explain that in a later video. Like I say, that is something I'm looking forward to configuring. Going to also, I like, I like this option myself. This is to transmit messages that you receive via the internet to the radios. This will transmit via channel zero with a path of wide one one. So it should only transmit people who I basically can hear. Okay. I'm also gonna put a filter on things that we are gonna retrieve from the internet. I like this filter. Only objects within 50 kilometers of my location. We could add other filters. That's a little beyond uh, this, this tutorial here. We'll also want to disable this. This will allow us to transmit maximum of six packets in a one minute period or 10 packets in a five minute period. This just stops us from flooding the network. APRS touch tone gateway. We don't need to do anything down here. I know Basil has Quite a bit enabled here and you can do a lot of really neat things with direwolf and touch tones but i haven't enabled or played with any of that yet so that though is effectively all we need to do do control x save this say yes sorry save as etc direwolf conf and enter that should take care of the draws hat I'm just going to flip back to the build up pie here and go through it very quickly just to show you the areas that we would need to change and how my build up pie is set up. So we shouldn't need to change anything here. My call sign is already in there. I'm not going to be a beacon or a digipeter. And here's our internet gateway section. I'm going to uncomment this. We're also going to uncomment this put our own call sign in here. And password from our call pass. I'm going to uncomment this one. to open up an additional tab, type in GPS mon 491. So we're going to uncomment the relay for messages so we become a messaging iGate server and we don't want to flood the radio channel. That should be it also. Control X, save, yes. Direwolf conf, yes. We can exit out of this. We can control C out of that and exit. Back to the draws hat. Draws had I have this icon here to start my AX25 stack, start Direwolf as well as KISS. You can see here I'm connecting to the iGate server. I have logged in, verified my status. And there you see after a 30 second delay, 
I just sent out a blurb to the internet. If we open up a web browser, go to aprs.fi and now see VE7 Tango Golf Zulu. It's online. Raspberry Pi draws hat split channel. Let's do the same over here on the build a pie. I'm going to start up my pad menu. I'm going to just start the packet modem. Fire up Direwolf. Do a kiss attach. Pat's not running. So I get an error there, but I'll just close that. Now, I don't have log files like I do on my draws hat yet on my build a pie. That is on my list. If we open aprs.fi here, and wait for a moment, we should see VA7SHG show up. And there it is. VA7SHG, Raspberry Pi, build a pie, iGate. I hope that helps you. Until the next video, 7-3.